Fifth row, Sammy Piazza and Cole Harris. Here we come on a turn number four this time. We go racing. Brad Arnold has absolutely the best of the best at the Big Diamond Speedway, and boy, are they rambling and scrambling, but no yellow flag. Everybody's in the right direction. Oh, that's ugly. Yellow lights. Two laps down. They work about a turn number two this time. To the inside, rides Jeff Strunk. Strunk down the back straightaway, full head of steam, and he's your new race leader after three laps of competition. Cole Harris then rides in spot number eight. Mike Mamana is ninth, and Neil Williams rounds out the top ten. Well, Neil Williams bobbled off the playboard for just a second, came back out. Caution lights on the speedway. And Speedway Pace Truck leaves the scene down there in the third turn area. Strunk on the inside again brings that pack of small block horsepower from turn number four. Dwayne Howard tries to stay with it this time. Howard on the outside, the Blue Bell Air Car now making strides down the back straightaway. Howard on the outside, gonna see turn number three just a tad bit quicker than does Jeff Strunk. Strunk right there. On the top side, just four more laps to go. And Dwayne Howard looks to make it win number two in the 2012 racing season here at the Big Diamond Speedway. Howard shows the way down the home stretch that time. Swinehart and Albert go out for spots number four and five. Checkered flag comes out. Make the check payable tonight to Dwayne Howard. Jeff Strunk second, Keith Hoffman third. Swinehart and a whisker by the number four spot. The winner of the 25 laps, Bob Block featured tonight, Twain Howard.